Hello and welcome to another video from Let's Drink Tea. Today we're going to brew Golden Monkey Tea, which is a Chinese black tea. It's actually one of the highest quality black teas, made from just the youngest buds and leaves. And it's one of my favorite teas. So, um, uh, the, you'll probably read, the, there's a lot of different ways to brew this tea. If you use the Gong Fu method, you would use a lot of leaves and uh, very short steeping times. If you use more of a, the Western method, you would use fewer leaves much longer steeping times. I always kind of go in the middle, you know, as with all teas, you just kind of have to experiment a bit. So um, I would use about one to two, two teaspoons of leaves for every eight ounces of water and then steep it for about two minutes on the first try. And um, in China, they always wash their leaves, uh, at least with, uh, here you can take a look at them if you can see that, a really beautiful tea. At least with uh, black and oolong teas, they will always wash the leaves for about a second or two in uh, the hot water. So I'll do the same, and you know, I don't know if what it does exactly, if it helps, but it certainly can't hurt. So I just use this because this is uh, much too deep. I would have to use too much water. So I just do it in here, put some water over the leaves real quick, swish it for a second, and that's good. And there we go. And to brew today, I'm going to use this because it's a, a see-through container, right? Um, usually I would brew black tea in an Yixing or maybe a Gaiwan, uh, but you can use anything really. And like I said, um, steep it for about two minutes and the water should be just below boiling. Um, this is a little colder now because it's been sitting here for a minute, but it'll still work. So really, you, you want to boil it and then immediately use it. So anyways, let's pour that in here. Alright, you can see the water immediately takes on kind of a nice golden color and we'll wait two minutes and that will get quite a bit darker. Uh, while we're waiting here, check out the leaves. If you want, this is a, a little bag I bought at a Chinese grocery store. Um, you can just, they just have the leaves in big bins and you just fill up these little Ziploc bags. Not the greatest way to store them, but you just buy small amounts and you finish it in like a week or two, so no problem. All right, we're back. It's been about two minutes, so let's go ahead and take the leaves back out of the water. Yep. And I'm going to save them because you can get about three to five infusions out of Golden Monkey Tea. Um, I'm going to get about four out of this one. I've used this before, so I, I know that. And I will increase the steeping time about 30 seconds for each subsequent infusion. And then for the last one, I usually just leave the leaves in there for, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes, you know, just to get every last bit of tea out of the leaves. And that means that the last infusion is much stronger than the others, but, you know, I don't mind strong tea. Um, you can see the the nice color of this one here. It's actually maybe a slightly weak one with the two minutes, so you could go to three minutes to make it much stronger. But like I said, I, I, I'm getting four infusions out of this, and I think if I went to three minutes on the first one, I wouldn't. So, you know, this works. I, I don't mind the tea a little milder either. And uh, the second and third one will generally be a bit stronger, and the fourth one will be the strongest. All right, if you have any questions or comments, you can leave them in the comment section below or just head to letsdrinktea.com. Uh, you can also find much more on Golden Monkey Tea there and also on any other kind of tea. Thanks for watching.